was on my rounds today. I had to go over to Facebook, so I thought, well, I like just looking at the few posts that are there straight in front of me. Facebook's not my favourite place. I like to go messages, I like to go to the groups and put the links out. I'm not interested in all the horribleness that happens on Facebook and yet they don't seem to really notice it. But you put one little thing out they don't like, crash, that's it, you're blocked. It's pathetic really. But anyway, my lovely friend Monique, there she is, the Yorkshire Vintage Rose. She um, loves sewing. So I'm just going to include a few minutes out of a hangout we had a few months ago. I think it was a few months ago, yeah, time flies. Um, yeah, she was on a hangout with um, Gillian and me and Amy. This is Monique here. And um, what it is is Monique has gone through enough stress and strain in her own life. She is lovely through it, an amazing lady. But in it, you know, and to make a living and she actually does something she really likes she sews and she's getting these workshops and she's teaching and all credit to her really pleased for her um she's going to talk for a few minutes here and you know there's a couple of reasons i think it's good eh she is saying this is really good for stress levels. It may not be your cup of tea, but it might be some people's cup of teas and don't realize that they've got a little art in sewing and it can help with their stress because obviously these kind of things help. And the other thing obviously is that we don't know how to sew anymore. We either throw it away or get someone to mend it and those days are gone. We just usually throw it away or get another one. Monique mends things. She doesn't just sew, she does patchwork, she does art, she does a myriad of things. But I suppose it's all expression, isn't it? All expression of yourself. And I love the words that she says in these few minutes. So let's play her video. Good. It's Monique's turn now. My turn, yeah. Yes, Monique, you're... Monique, do you want me to get up something on Facebook? Just, just if you wanted to. What do you want to talk about? Do you want to talk about your sewing, or and and the stuff we talked about, or do you want to talk about something else? Oh, I don't mind talking about the sewing. <laughs> Should I put it? Oh, hang on a second. I'm just going to stop the video again. Back with Monique's page on Facebook. And Monique yes. likes sewing, don't you, Monique? I do. <laughs> Anything creative, really. Sewing and art is one of the main things I do, actually. So you made the little girl's dress, then? Yes. <clears throat> yes, I love making little girl's dresses. That's one of my favourite things. Um, but I also teach. I do patchwork as well. Um, and I do kind of zen um, sort of artwork. Um, which I'm hoping to teach and it's basically doing crafts for people and it just kind of makes people feel a little bit more in the now helps people with their kind of depressions or problems and gives them a bit of a boost and a feel good factor really um, so if you do scroll down my page you'll see some bit of artwork that I'm doing which is something that I like to do with a bit of meditation or even hand yoga. Um, oh yeah, we were with um, really enjoyable evening with the ladies. Thank you for joining me. What's that one about, Monique? Yeah, I thought. Oh, let me see. Yeah, that was teaching them patchwork. With that one. Yeah, that's that's another thing that you've got into. Is you're a teacher now, aren't you? Yeah, I like to teach. Yes, I like to teach. As I say, I'm trying to do it with a bit more of a zen, you know, because it's like <laughs> getting people to actually chill out and it helps them with um, depression, it helps them with any kind of problems they have and to give themselves a bit of time, you know, to do something and to forget about all the stresses in the world. Because we have had a lot over a couple of years, haven't we, and we have a lot, quite a lot now. But I've also noticed that a lot of young people, um, and this is horrible to say, but um, you know, my, my children have had friends that have given up and kind of 
passed away and taken their own lives. And I think with the way the world is, we're needing to kind of assess people with mental health and help other people. You know, you just don't know next door what people are going through, and especially with the past few years. Yeah. yeah. I, I just like to help people that way. I think everyone can be creative. I think a lot of people that come with their beginners will say, no, I can't do this, I'm not very good. And then what's so nice is actually showing them something and they've achieved it. And that, that kind of feeling of that, yes, you can do this. Oh, you can put pen to paper. You don't have to be um, a Leonardo or whatever. It's what art you do with me is personal art to yourself. It's not to show anyone, it's to actually um, get a good feeling and to enjoy it. It's not to make the statement. You know, so I like to teach people art that way. Um, so they get fulfillment. So it's amazing what people can create. Um, yeah. Oh, Monique. Nice.